Greetings everyone and welcome back to Two Point Hospital in what should be the next episode. But unfortunately, the episode I recorded before this one, uh, Windows Update happened. And Windows Update hates me. Windows Update meant that the uh, episode was recorded without any audio because Windows decided to reset all my audio devices. I am most sad, but here's what we've changed in your absence. We have expanded out our uh, a new ward, new GP's office. We've got a new fluid analysis, uh, accelerator, sorry, a psychiatry and a new loo. Marvelous. All right, Blala has 100% repetition. Well done, Blala. Now, we've also managed to train up a significant number of our staff. And you may notice we're actually a lot closer to the third star than you may have previously thought. I do apologize for, for not being able to bring you along for that particular journey. Though, as you can see, we didn't actually get that many new buildings. So it was mostly just placing down a couple of rooms and then uh, trying to, to work on the kinks in the system and get the right people trained to do the right jobs. So uh, hopefully you, you won't have missed too much. Now, currently, we are working on upgrading a chromotherapy. We've got a number of upgraded facilities in the hospital. In fact, we need to upgrade this one since it was a recently built one here. Please respect the hospital now, no I'm really thinking, really, really thinking that it might be better for me to have all of my GPs down here and then just send people on to be treated in different, different areas. I think that might actually genuinely be a much better system. Uh... Could have chromotherapy, for example, down there. And then we'd have most of the clinics in this area, along with a, a lavatory. A staff room, not really. That would have to be over there. But we could move that psychiatry up there, perhaps. Hmm. Tempting, actually. Very tempting. I may have to uh, consider that one. Uh, right, well, we've got a promotion at any rate. So let's uh, get that one done. Now then, we've got only a couple more people that we need to train before we hit... Oh, well, one more person before we hit a uh, three-star hospital. Let's go and have a look at our staff and see just how they're all doing. How many staff have we got that we can train in any particular job? Well, we could push our researchers up to the very next level, I suppose. We can also now build the Mega Scanner because I've got a couple of people trained in radiology. Uh, alternatively, and more interestingly, I think we're going to go for General Practice 3, which will increase an extra 10% um, on GP's training abilities. We'll only train Dr. Julia Force in this one, and then uh, Dr. Force will train everyone else. All right, so in the My uh, meanwhile... I need to relax more. Find a hobby. If you have any suggestions, please send them in. I'll keep you posted on how my search goes. Okay. Anything's better than my last hobby. Collecting traffic cones. Well, we've got enough money to expand into this little area. Now, what I'm thinking we might want to do is if I can move all of the diagnosis equipment across there. Wow. That being said. If we imagine that I've got all my GPs here, generally speaking, there'll also be a lavatory and a, a staff room, then maybe the next best place is to pop all of the second tier diagnosis um, stuff over here. I'm not going to have psychiatry there though. Psychiatry will have its own wing. There'll be quite a few psychiatrists there. So, yeah. Let's let's move across the uh, Deluxe and the Dehumifier. Since these are treatments, by the time that someone gets here, they can just walk over there and they're not going to have any way to walk back to other than out of the hospital. So that seems like a reasonable one to have at possibly one of the furthest points away from the hospital. In fact, we're just going to go and buy all of these so I can start laying down some plans. I think this is the way we're going to move forward. So, first and foremost, let's go to the labs. We've got chromotherapy. Let's leave you a decent bit of room, shall we? I'm going to want this one to be a fairly large room. Um, sure. We'll have chromotherapy machine right about there. Yeah, we'll pop it up against the wall. I'll pop you there. Now, I would like a window or two, if I can help it. Let's get two windows over there. We obviously need fire extinguishers. And let's keep these reasonably close to the doors, just so that uh, if there is a fire, then it's quick to deal with. Pop you down there. Get a certificate over there. Um, that'll do. 
Also pop little plants right next to it. There we are. I mean, I kind of can't argue with with that. Honestly, it kind of makes sense. Let let let's not just waste all all of those resources that that are you. It's quite a lot of material that goes into a person that could be better used elsewhere. Uh, well, <laughs> better used elsewhere. It sounds like I want to proactively take it off you and then use it for a better better thing rather than waiting until you no longer need it anymore. That is not quite where I was going to begin with. And yes, to begin with, because now it is absolutely where I'm going with that. Makes sense when you think about it. All right, let's get down Players this thing. To stay I will try. I promise I'll do my best. Okay, so we've got our chromotherapy. Uh, chromotherapy doesn't need too much attention, I don't think. And we'll get our deluxe clinic as well. So let's pop you over here. And these can be nice big rooms. I don't think we need to make them small. Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Ah, I think I just snapped one of my ribs. All right, there we go. Let's pop you in there. Bonk. And once again, uh, let's pop this back a little bit. There we go. Now, I'd like a plant over here. And definitely have a chair as well. We'll have this one over on this side, though. Pop it right about there. Get the hand sanitizer in there. Uh, let's have two certificates on this wall. And the particularly accomplished uh, the deluxe clinic. Uh, we want a water cooler so that people can at least quench their thirst while in here. And some more paintings. Oops! Oh, we've got it! There we are. Dear Hospital Administrator, three stars. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded the three star rating by Two Point Health Ministry. You have established a first-class research institute and a terrific boon to the university. I'm told that they're very grateful, and I'd imagine I'm supposed to be too. Uh, supposed to be too. Alas, ah, uh, Tarquin, Tarquin, why? Supercomputer and a drug mixer three. Oh, I like it. Let's uh, pop that in there. We'll get a new painting over here. On all of the paintings we can. Uh, actually get some pictures over there as well. I think that's lovely. Clock wouldn't go amiss. Sure. We are going to need a bin. We'll pop the bin over there. And of course, some extinguishers as well. And there, and can we squeeze one in over here, perhaps somewhere? Mm, probably can if I just move, well, no, if I move that. Oh, we'll just go with one. It's fine. Uh, what have I lost? Oh, it was actually telling me what I, what I was gonna lose. To be fair to it, it was trying its best. It was like, yeah, you yeah, see the big old, uh, Money symbol? It means that you're trying to put something in a stupid place. Please fix it. Uh, right, okay. Where are we going to pop you? Let's pop you underneath that painting. That's good enough. And... You there. There we go. Perfect. I approve. Alright, with that done, we can get rid of two rooms. Colorizer 2 unlocked. Marvellous. I approve. Let's get you all trained up. There we go. Not now. A little bit more training for you. Research. Colorizer 2 is done. Right, I would like... Hmm, should we go for more money? <gasps> I can't get more money. Oh, well, try it. I In the the episode that, that was lost to the ravages of Windows Update, I had actually done a little bit of research and made 20, 20k, but apparently I can't do it then anymore. It makes me very sad. Uh, should we take research? Yeah, sure. We'll grab the, the, the latest in researchering. Uh, and I'm also going to get my researchers trained in Researching 3. Both of them, please. Uh, oh, no, we've already got Research 3. Oh! Well, okay, never mind. Never mind. Uh, that works quite well. Uh, very well. Let's see. Could we perhaps go for... Oh, general practice for... I wouldn't mind it. Really wouldn't mind it. Uh, oh, let's go for General Practice 3 for now. Right, okay, so, who are we going to train up? You three, for definite. Get to learning, please. Right, so we've got our two, um, two clinics over here. Let's pop down a couple of things in the corridor, and then we're going to shift out the previous clinics. Uh, do we want benches along here? I would say no, for the most part, but we will have one or two benches. Please respect the hospital grounds. No, 
Generally speaking, I'm going to say that these benches shouldn't be the, the main ones used, because I would like to keep most of my people together over here. But we'll have two. Uh, we'll have a bin across here, maybe flanked by something like... Uh, let's go for a luxury drinks machine right there. And then possibly something to, to amuse other than the game. Uh, let's see... Oh, we can have a clock above the bin at the very least. Maybe a telephone. Let's uh, just slide that across a little bit. There we go. That's actually quite nice. So at least you've got somewhere to sit right now. That actually looks kind of nice. Okay. The forty-fifth caller now. today will win tickets to the Rock Festival taking place next month. I admire a station manager's optimism. The most callers we've ever had in a day was six. Two of them were wrong numbers. Defeat ex expected is defeat accepted. You must you must get past this. Right, let's see. Have we done well? I would hope so. Yes, we have. For the fourth year in a row, we've won Doctor of the Year. And the sixth year in a row, we won Rising Star. I'm actually pretty pleased with that myself. Right, bomb. Look at that. Marvelous. Is it OTT? Absolutely. Do I care? Absolutely not. Uh, what else would I like to do over here? Let's pop down some purple benches. Lady Shelab's favorite color, as it happens. Uh, right, yeah, we'll pop down two there. And two on the other side as well. Should I go for some heat? I probably should. Let's be perfectly honest with ourselves. Pop this there, maybe. Yeah, that works well. Okay, with that in place... Let's get something like a news agent. Sure, pop you right there. And we'll have something over on the other side. Now, on this side is where I would like to build... Hmm, what are we gonna go with? Uh, let's go for the dehumifier, I think. Let's, let's grab you and get you built. So, dehumifier next. We've got these two. Next up, we want you. And we want one, two, so one, two, there we are, and then no just go out for four. Oh, we've already had this discussion. Why Why are you so shenanigadist? Scallywag that you are. All right, let's uh, tuck that in. Right, can we unlock a load of things in here? I really hope we can. I love decorating this room in particular. It's got really nice decorations, I feel. There we are. Let's get... What other things can we get? Cannon! Absolutely! So, there is definitely a part of me that feels worse about decorating this room and making it look so happy and fun, knowing what's going to happen to them when they get in here. <sighs> We're kind of Patience, monsters, really, aren't we? At all times. That needs to be moved. Uh, down here, maybe? Pop you over there. Maybe just... Can I shift you just a tad? Sort of fit in right there. That'll have to do. Uh, right, we're gonna need a bin. Put the bin right at the back. And I don't want a clock in here. No, we want this to be, be a, a fun and, and uh, jovial place. Get a rose down here as well. Do I want hand sanitizer? I do want a hand sanitizer, though. It's, it's... Look, having clean hands is fun. I said so. Uh, right. Uh, let's also have some windows. Just so, you know, they can see people's joy being sucked out of them. We're basically joy vampires. <sighs> Why is it whenever you clip your nails... No, not this one! Computer, ...one of the nails always flies into the cracks of your keyboard. Does the keyboard feed on them? I don't know. No one knows. Why do you keep asking this question? It goes through me every time. Right, so that's the dehumifier. I think that's all of these ones. Yep. And I guess we could put a pans lab down here. Should we? Is the question. And I think the answer to that question is yes. Gift shop. Let's get you in there as well. Let's line it up properly, though. There we go. Bump. Please drive home safely. Perfect. And soon. Excellent. Wonderful. Right, so Pan's Lab is up next. And then we pretty much got them all. So, 
you need to go down about here. And then if we want more, we can just add more. Uh, clinics, that is. Uh, so we don't need to just have th this limited number. Get a regular plant in there. And the radiator just underneath that window. Dr. Um, Honeydew needed in research. There we go. Let's pop you down. And get a couple of certificates in here as well. There we are. Marvellous. Right. Uh, do we want... Well, we should probably have a cupboard. I just refuse to have these sorts of things in the clown tent. I just feel that they're a bit of a drag. They, they, they aren't in keeping with the theme. No, these are far too too practical. We don't want the clowns to catch on to the horrible, horrible things we're about to do. I can't believe I'm feeling sympathetic with clowns. What has this game done to me? Right, let's find those wonderful benches. There we go. Once again, just two will do. And we'll get... Let's go for a luxury snacks machine. We're not going to go for salty snacks over here. Luxury snack machine. All I want there. And probably a bin next to it really as well. Uh, maybe a sweet machine on this side. You know, you can go for the savory or you can go for sweet. Makes sense to me. Uh, where are you? There we are. I'll pop a bin right there. And a clock above the radiator. Excellent. Looks good if you ask me. Now, hey, how does this area up? Yeah, it looks good enough. Kindly get out. There's nothing kind about that request. Not even slightly. Now, ideally, we wouldn't have people waiting over here. So, instead, well, I don't know. Maybe we will end up with a couple of people waiting. Okay, let, let's build for the potential long queue. So, let's have you facing the beautiful fountain. There we are. That'd be quite nice. And maybe... Oop, that is not centred, even slightly. There you go. In the event of a fire, please run for your lives. Good advice, I must say. Let's have something nice behind these ones, perhaps. Uh, let's see. Is there anything nice to put behind them? Have I got anything? I wish I had statues. But alas, I do not. Much sad. I can put bins behind them, but that doesn't really feel right. Uh, okay, well, let's have a look at how it looks right now. You know what? I think it'll be okay if we pop the uh, extra benches there as well. It's not exactly a, a normal setup, but I think it'll work. Right, next, we want toilets then. I wasn't going to put toilets over here, but I guess we can make that happen. Alright, let's get one, two... Three, four, two hand drives maybe in the middle there, and then a sink on either side. We could possibly squeeze in an extra. If you're ladder feeling well, ill, actually. the last thing you want to do is pump your body full of cheap artificial medicine. Okay. So stay at a holistics hospital where our natural remedies are so mm. expensive they just have to be good for you. Holistics. Not where sure you can that's how that instead. works. Really not Sonic sure. This is Think you might be radio. wrong. Let's go for two little radiators. This is a very non standard bathroom. I think I got a little bit too obsessed with symmetry. This is the peril, everyone. Alright, let's have a look. Is it warm enough? Yeah, it's more or less warm enough. Right, okay, well, given that then, uh, let's pop down some items out here. I think we're going to have magazine racks. Have one there. We'll have maybe Stop telephone booths. Or maybe even two telephone booths. One. Can't fit the other one in there. We'll have two then, that's fine. And a pin. That should do. Yes, I'm liking that. So that's all of our clinics. Now, the reason, again, that I put them over here is that, ultimately, we don't need the clinics to be near where we're going to be diagnosing people. Because it's the it's that's the end of their journey. We want them to move through the hospital 
in a journey. So they get diagnosed here, and if they're lucky enough to be immediately diagnosed with what's wrong, they can go up there and be treated. If not, though, they go for additional treatments in, in these sorts of areas, and we'll uh, keep them moving gradually through the area. Uh, no, we won't train you right now. Right, how are we doing down here then? We could go for the next research level, I think we should. Let's get both of you trained up. Begin your training right now. The nice thing about training them Attention. is that it doesn't take any doctors away from anything Anywhere else, which is actually pretty cool. Will not be tolerated. Right, so the plan now is to replace these with pretty much just all GP's offices, which means I need to move some of the, the clinics away that we've got down here. I would like you to be switched with... Maybe we could turn this into just four psychiatry rooms. Uh, we got a decent amount of seating out there, so... But my psychiatry rooms do tend to take a lot of people. Hmm. And this is only 16 people's worth of... Uh, sorry, um, yeah, 16 people's worth of seating. We could probably squeeze in a little bit more there. At least it does have a, a lavatory, though. That is a small mercy. Uh, I could make that into a... A little staff room, perhaps, and just have all of these be psychiatry rooms. Or I could squeeze in some more rooms. Or maybe maybe make that a staff room, and then have three Don't psychiatry, four psychiatry. I think that might work. All right. Well, as soon as you're done, I'm going to be selling that room. In fact, I'm also going to be selling this one, so let's get you out of the way. Womp. Goodbye. On two point radio. Anyone waiting for this one? Welcome Good. back to your oh, favorite well, radio station, here, station yeah. with the vastly oh, overqualified yes, Sir Nigel Bickleworth. I'm here to inform, and to entertain, and to bring some got... small measure of sophistication okay. to your drab little lives. Should any of you so have any requests for popular tunes, as I believe people like to call them, so do not hesitate hit? to repress that impulse. I have Rubbish no intention of playing any of that drivel. Right, this needs to go as well. Womp. There we go. Okay, so now we've got some room to play with. Let's get down the psychiatry rooms first, shall we? Since it's more important that they're actually built before anything else. We could have them as, as large... Yeah, we could have three long rooms like this. That wouldn't be a problem, actually. Hmm, I like the idea of this. Be there. What a fireplace on this wall, flanked by wonderful things. There we are. And we'll have a, a little screen about there. Allow people to have a, a bit of privacy. Only the special ones, though. We're very, very clear on that. It has to be a special. You know what? I'm going to have a small radiator in here. I don't know. We'll see if it's a bit too much with the uh, with the fireplace as well. We'll have to see. Uh, I'd like a cupboard. Sure. And then a coffee machine just off to the side. I wish I could have it in a darker wood. Alas, seems quite impossible. Ah, uh, see, I feel like I need to center this. I'll do. I have that right there. There we go. Could I have a lamp behind, maybe? Oh, we can definitely have a bin, though. At the very least, we can have a nice bin. There we go. Pop an old clock up on the wall. How much I would give to be able to put it above my fireplace. Oh. Uh, alas. I can't. Hmm. Okay. Well, I want it somewhere where my, where my psychiatrist can actually see the thing. We'll pop her over there, then. Uh, what else? Let's have a, a... We want a raw shash poster. I hope I'm saying that right. Thank you. Get... Uh, no, you've got a gold star. You're, you're one of the very best psychiatrists who's ever competed in the eat all you can mac and cheese contest. We'll allow the patients to assume it's something related to your qualification though. What they don't know won't hurt them. Uh, pop this down there. I think that's good enough. So level for psychiatry. Yes. Let's get that done. Beauteous. Absolutely beautiful. Taking a look at our staff morale. Apparently, Lala, our online rival, has the highest score. Oh. 
Politics is apparently going to open another of its nature communes for sick people with more sense than money. Fortunately, I have equal amounts of sense and money. I had not seen this this disease before. That's actually quite fascinating. I approve. I mean, not of the disease, of course, but uh, I approve of discovering new things. I like it. All right, let's get a, a new psychiatrist over here. Yeah, it's just a smaller one. This is the office of someone who did not win first prize in the mac and cheese eating contest. No, no, no. They won second place at best. Still, I feel that they deserve to have a few of the niceties. All psychiatrists deserve these things. Uh, do you deserve this? I will allow it. Wash their hands at all times. I'm too good to you, really. Uh, let's pop a lamp in there. Get a nice rug as well. We'll have this rug. I'm gonna be offset a little bit. It will melt some people's brains, but that's fine. We're melting out the bad parts. It's like it's like laser surgery for bad thoughts. There we go, and we'll get bin. Go tucked into the corner next to a rose, probably. Let's get a rose over there. And then coffee machine. I really feel that we should have a coffee machine everywhere we can. Yeah. Yeah, we'll pop it there. And that means we're gonna get rid of that. And we'll pop in a to the owner of the bluish car. Second place price. Your car is being taken for cubing. Mm. That's a bluish car for cubing. You got a clock Thank in here? You. We do not, so we need one. Pop it about here, right in the middle if we can. Can't. Oh, actually, no, we've already got one. Never mind. Never mind. I'm, I'm talking rubbish. Where's the hand sanitizer then? We definitely want that in here. Can I pop that anywhere? No. Oh, that's a bit frustrating, but alright. Pop it there, maybe. Just need a tiny bit more. Uh, how about another plant? No, can't fit it in there. Hmm. Cupboard, perhaps? Maybe a, just a trophy rack? No, I'll try it. Okay, well, let's pop down a, another heater at any rate. Uh, invalid items too. What do we lose? We lost the hand sanitizer and our plants. That's not acceptable. No, no. No. I, I would no. What? I want to act. No, no. I want. There we are. I want to just. Interact with the room. My lord. That was a bit of a saga. There we go. And... Oh no, we got the hand sanitizer still. Oh, possibly a bin was misplaced. Hmm. Let's get a bin in there then. Can we fit you in? Not easily. In any way that we would be now useful. bring you this segment, oh, well. Sir Nigel Reviews. Maybe. Today I take a look at the new fine mm. dining establishment. Oh, well. I'll have to do. Le right, let's have a look at the temperatures. And what a delight for the They're experienced not too bad. Good. palate good, this good, good, good. is. The scrambled emu eggs on pickled toast are particularly good. I give it four salt shakers. All right, we've got some burp here. Let's get Please rid of that and replace it with some. Let's see, loose juice. Yeah, I'll do. Over here, I would like sweet dispenser, maybe. Sure. Uh, I've got a decent amount of seating right there, but I'm thinking we do want some more over here. Is that going to be a little bit too close, though? Mm. It's going to be close somewhere, basically, and there's not much I can do about that. Janitor. Alternatively, I could have these ones against the wall. I guess that wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, let's go for one of the silver benches then in that case. In fact, I move this elsewhere. No, it's just going to have to live there. Is this nice looking area already? Could do with a little bit of a pick me up. Let's pop up some posters maybe. Alas, no, apparently. Hmm. Nope, nope, won't go there. How about you? Can I tuck you into the corner? 
Maybe that'll affect it. Yeah, there we go. There we are. Just in case they forget they're in the hospital. Alright, how's everything going? Things should be okay up here, I would imagine. We do actually need a couple of new assistants, though, I would say. Let's have a look. Uh, messy, natural mentor, though. Charisma. Oh, yes, I like you. You can go and work here. There you are. Alright, let's have a quick glance. How much training can we train? In fact, I think my uh, research stuff. Oh, wait, I haven't rebuilt my research area yet. Uh, that's a good point. Oh, dear. That is unfortunate, to say the very, very least. Uh, well, we are going to need a staff room and we've already got a lavatory. Let's pop down a new research room over here, then. Let's get you built up. There we are. And by making this research room, we're going to uh, get away from the need to have many benches out there, because obviously we don't need benches for a research room. Let's pop you there, and there, and we just want one or two desks Natasha, as well. Urinating anywhere in the hospital will not be tolerated. That's right, they won't. Now, we've got a server and we've got a supercomputer, plus two research power, my lord. Uh, we'll get two servers perhaps over here. Now these things are going to run hot, so we want to avoid and not get too out of hand. Let's get a nice big bin. We want a rose over here. Sunflower down in the corner down here. Coffee machine, obviously. Right there. Certificate as well. We're already prestige level. That doesn't surprise me at all. Not even slightly. How about some extra posters as well? And this one perhaps. There we go. It's happening again. I think that should do. Let's have a look at how warm this room is. Yeah, they're actually keeping it warm. Nice. Point Very nice. Alright, what are we going to go Our for? Our reporter on the field, Sally Fig Blanket, has just returned with her camera crew from another field trip. As to what she was reporting on, I cannot say. Nobody tells me oh. anything. That was awesome. And I, I, I especially like, and that is, by that I mean I don't like, the fact that you celebrated that the poor clown had lost all of its fun. There are not good people in this hospital, we really aren't. Uh, unless you're terrified of clowns. I forget what the phobia of clowns is. But if you're terrified of clowns, then we're doing, doing the Lord's work, apparently. Right, uh, let's get you centered. Perfect. I likes. Uh, let's get a trophy... Rack, um, right about there, that'll do. And I definitely want a coffee machine, obviously. Got a sunflower right about there. Don't mind me, I just like talking into Ooh. a microphone. Know what, we can have luxury snacks machine right there. Then moose juice over there. Oh, that actually works out quite well. I like it. Any other things we can grab in here? No, not really. Good Bit of a shame there. What about a dartboard then? Uh, we'll have a dartboard right there. Possibly just gra get a uh, couple of bean bags around here. I like that. And then a few games. Uh, sure, we can have that in the middle. That wasn't really what I was aiming for, but uh, that'll work. Little little radiator there. A bigger radiator on this side. Attention. There we are. Urinating. I'm not going to go for TV in this room, though. I think I'm happy without it. We'll get a certificate up over here, though. And another rug, perhaps. Sure, though, I'm going to need to move these around a little bit to make that feel right. Actually, what, what am I talking about? They're a bunch of beanbag chairs. They thrive on being not quite organized. It's the whole point. Thing is, I don't really want them to be... Actually, no. Let's get them all down here. Don't forget there we are. To tip your that looks quite nice. We'll get a, get a cactus or something. Right there. Perfect. Prestige level four. 
I approve. Marvellous. It's not amazing. I wish it was a circular rug because I would 100% have gone for that, but uh, oh well. All right, let's jump on nuts. Let's go for... Let's get some palpitation up here. All right, how are we doing heat-wise? Not great, but a small radiator should do all the work we need. And a hand sanitizer for good measure, I think. Maybe a plant, too. There we are. Uh, over here, there's this little gap that I'm not enjoying as much. So let's move you across and maybe get a yucca plant. Right there. I think I think it's yucca. I'm, I'm not sure. It could be yucca. Uh, I've got magazines over there, so we don't need In those. Event of an epidemic, please try not to panic. Terrible things happen every day. You could lose a toe. Ah! Your house. Ah! Even your life. It's a bit on the nose for a That's hospital, mate. Eh? Insurance like Swindles Insurance. <sighs> Swindles, because peace of mind is worth a piece of your soul. There we go. Lovely. This is there we go. Radio. I like it. Oh dear. Got uh, no psychiatrist over here. That's actually kind of terrible, in fact. Now let's find out what's happening. Where are my psychiatrists then? Got 13 doctors. Can't all be doing other things. Uh, you are presently doing psychiatry? Some of you are doing. Yeah, honestly, we actually need more psychiatrists. More trained psychiatrists. Okay, that's going to be what we're going to aim for, I think. Let's get you opened up. Okay, not too bad. Alright, well, two psychiatrists not available. Still, cues aren't too bad. Well, actually, I say that, but that's awful. We definitely need more staff who can perform psychiatry. Let's have a look. Has potential charismatic. Yes, I'll take you. And class clown, grumpy. Hygienic, weak bladder, girl next door, green fingers. Okay. And unhygienic, has regrets. Well, no, weak bladder isn't too bad. Right. It's happening again. Let's get you guys trained, shall we? One of our own, very own doctors to train you. All three of you. Anyone else we want trained? Um, no, no, I would say not. Let's just get you trained up to the first level. Then I think we're going to go for the second level of psychiatry on uh, my consultants there. Maybe the third level as well? We'll see. We'll see. I might have you three be dedicated psychiatrists. That would actually be quite nice, I think. Very, very useful. Uh, how's everything going? I'm going to actually get rid of this room. We don't need it here. Womp. There we are. You can head on over there. Should be fine. But we are going to want more psychiatry rooms. I'm going to get rid of this one just because it's going to distract my staff for a little bit. And in exchange, you're going to get a proper staff room. And then I think we're going to have to wrap up the episode because it has gone on a little while. There we are. But I would be very, very keen to hear what you think about the, the redesign and uh, my, my uh, plans around it and the way that I'm laying things out. Do you think this is a, a good way to redesign it? To have the, the sort of uh, a, a flow to the traffic that we can kind of dictate and control? Uh, or do you prefer the, the sort of having a little bit of, of everything going on that we've had up to now? I want a table there instead. Table at the top? Yes, it is. Let's pop that right there. I wish, I wish so hard that I could have a uh, something on the table. Oh my lord. It would be so grand. How about we slide you guys across a little bit, eh? About to there. Pop. Then pop you. Oh, glorious. I likes it. Uh, right, let's move you across. There we go. That loop. Uh, right, now. If I would ever like you have found yourself at a loss as to the correct usage of the English language, you may enjoy my popular guide to good grammar. I'm not sure about that. I perform with no shortage of humility. Uh, I'm also absolutely certain you don't actually perform with well, any humility. But I fear your underdeveloped vocal abilities yep, there will we make go. this quite impossible. Told you. Right, let's pop this in there. We'll get some... Uh, yeah. Luxury drinks machine. Oop. And... Patients have reminded that 
This is Salty a snacks place. over here, actually. Not a theme park. There we go. Uh, what do we want up on this wall? Oh, a hand sanitizer, of course. We definitely want a bin in here because there are things that generate rubbish. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's get a notice board over the coffee machine because let, let's be honest, that's going to be where a lot of people are congregating. A sunflower over in this corner. That'll be lovely. Okay. Yeah, I'm liking it. I'm liking it so far. It's got a sweet machine in between the games machine. Oh, that, that's actually a really clever way, a clever thing to put there. I don't understand why I never thought of that before. That seems so fitting. Uh, do we have a clock? I'll pop. I'll pop the clock over here. Actually, I don't want it. I don't want it above the uh, the the couch because nothing is more frustrating than the tick tock tick tock of a clock right above your head that you can't see. Uh, is there anything else we want? No, I think we're I think we're good with that. Another level four staff room. Not too many people can can be sat down in there at a time, but still. It's uh, it's an improvement, I think. There we go. Right, but that's where we're going to be wrapping up this episode. I'm going to quickly get these promotions out of the way, of course. Uh, earn 100. That'll be easy for this hospital. There we go. But with that, I think we're ready to wrap things up here. I am going to continue expanding out this this hospital for another episode or two until the uh, until the cutoff time for the early access um, footage uh, arrives. And then we'll be waiting until the full release at the end of next month. But uh, that's going to be it from me for now. I really do hope you've enjoyed this episode and will be joining me for the next. But until then, and as always, do take care, everyone.